Hi guys, it's Puppeteer here again, got another micro tutorial for you all and today we're going to look at how to update the operating system of the Kurzweil PC3 I needed to do it anyway so that I can do some of the setup tutorials I'm currently running an alpha operating system on here and it's got a few weird things happening so what I'm going to do is take you through the procedure and show you how to apply the um, put the new operating system on Kurzweil PC3. First thing you need to do is you need to head over to Kurzweil.com and you need to download the operating system. Uh, you just go to downloads and then select your synthesizer. Uh, I think this is fairly similar between the PC3 and the later versions except with the later versions I don't think you need to run the, the initial file utility. So the first thing that we need to do before we do anything else is we need to save everything. So I've got a card in there and a USB temporary drive, it doesn't really matter which one you use, I'm going to use the card. So let's go store, let's uh, select all types and then select everything. Okay, you go store, I'm going to put it in my backup file folder in here and then I'm going to give it a name. Now I'm going to give it the name of today's date which is 2016 oh oops one and twenty nine okay so we're just going to let it do do its thing there for a little bit so a little bit wonky let's straighten up the camera while we're, while we're waiting oh I haven't got any light on either let me fix that up oh now we can see what we're doing Okay, that's all finished. Okay, so what we now need to do is that we need to reboot the system. So we power the PC3 off and we press and hold the exit button. So you can't see me holding the exit button, so press and hold the exit button. All right, this boots us into the bootloader. Okay. Now the first thing that we need to do, I've already copied the files onto my uh, XD card so the next thing that we need to do is we need to um, go to file utilities because we need to re, um, and we need to exec, exec from file. We, what we need to do at this stage is that we need to run a new bootloader and then we can choose the card or the USB port so I'm going to choose card and then what I need to do is I need to navigate down to the operating system. So I've got them all saved in a folder called operating system. So I go down and I've got the one that the latest one is O2B20. Is that it? Yep, that's it. I think that's the latest one. So go down and then what I need to do is we need to find this file called uh, PC3FT063. It's a bin file. Okay, and then what we do is we go choose. Okay, and that will load that. It's going to go blank for a little while and then it's going to come up again. So what we've now got is we've got a new, new bootloader in here. <coughs> so uh, next thing that we need to do is we need to go format flash. So we go format. Okay, so we're in formatting the internal file system. I'm just waiting. Okay, the next thing we need to do is we need to go update image. So we press this. See all these instructions, there's a readme file that comes with the operating system. So all of these instructions are actually in there and you can just follow through one at a time. I'm actually going through them as I'm reading them to you just to make sure <laughs> that um, I get it right because I don't want to stuff this up. <laughs> uh, so which module do we want to update? So we want to update the main image. We need to choose card 
and again I need to go down to my operating system folder which is down here we need to open it and then we need to go down to this one here and we go open and then we go down to the PC3 OS2 one which is this one here this is the latest operating system and then what we need to do is we need to press choose okay it's going to copy the image into the flash Okay, buildable system, that's all good news, so press OK. And then we need to go update image again, and this time we've got to install the objects. So we are going to choose main object. We need to go to card. I need to go down to OS again. Open. Open. And we need to go and choose the PC3 OB212. PC3, which is this file here. And we press choose. Okay, so it's copying all that in. <clears throat> so if you've got the Core64 installed, there's another step that you need to do here, and what that is, you need to repeat what we've just done, but you need to install the uh, the other data file, which is the xcore225.pc3. I haven't got Core64, so I'm going to skip, skip this step. So press OK. And then what we do is we press Quit. OK, and then we press Back and then we go run PC3 okay should reboot okay so we've got the new operating system down here 2.21 okay and just to confirm that the update was uh, installed we go into the master mode we press the object button okay and what we should have there was I haven't got Core 64, so it should say 2.12.0, which it does, and it should say 2.21.19920. It also says that uh, if you've got the Core 64, um, what will happen is that you'll have uh, 2.12.0, and then you'll have Alt 2.20.5 after it. Okay, so looks like our PC3 has all upgraded, all updated, really good. And we've got some sound. So thanks Vasters, that was a nice short tutorial on how to reformat or how to update the operating system on Kurzweil PC3. Come over and join us at Mastering Vast and uh, subscribe if you haven't already and we'll see you all soon. Catch you later.